Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So let's get started. First things first, I'm starting off with a fresh face and my foundation on. I'll link this routine below. And then I'm also using my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion, applying that all over my eyelids. Then I am taking a dense flat head shadow brush. I believe I got this off Amazon in a set of 10 for about 9 or $10. And I am using that to buff out the primer potion and give me a nice base to apply the shadow with. After getting a nice even eyeshadow base, I'm going to be taking my MAC 224 blending brush and my Naked Urban Decay flushed palette and I'm going to be using the bronzer today to define the crease and you can tell as usual I'm just putting this on in windshield wiping motions buffing it lightly into the crease this isn't going to be a very dramatic look we're just adding a little definition it's very subtle I love using bronzer as shadow I do it quite often and then you can see here I'm buffing it into the other side as well making sure both eyes are evenly distributed then I'm taking my Riri MAC freshed out palette and the darker golden color is what I'm going to be putting on first with my Dior Flathead number 13 brush and my Mario Badescu facial spray. I'm just adding that to the product on the brush to give it a more metallic and pigmented sheen as I apply it. And I'm only concentrating this right on the lid, the inner portion towards the outer, not bringing this up to the crease at all. Then I am taking the lightest gold color out of the palette and popping that right onto the center of my lid. I'm only concentrating this right in the center because that's where I want it to just have a little extra sheen and pop. I'm not applying it to the whole lid. Then I'm taking my favorite liquid eyeliner of all time, my Dior Show Art Pen, and I'm starting to map out my winged eyeliner. If you guys would like to see me do an in-depth tutorial on how to get the perfect wing, please let me know in the comments below. Otherwise, I highly recommend this product for somebody that's just starting to use liquid liner and trying to get the perfect wing. It's got the perfect felt tip that's pointed at the end that makes it really easy to get a precise wing. Voila! Our wing eyeliner is done. Now I am curling the lashes, prepping them for some falsies I'm going to be putting on soon. But next I'm going to take my MAC 217 blending brush with my Lorac Pro palette and finish up my eyes in the shade Sable. And I'm only applying the slightest bit to the brush. As you can see, not a lot of product. And I'm starting to buff that in from the outward crease inwards and just really slow buffing motions. I'm not taking a lot of this product and I'm not buffing it upwards into the crease. I'm concentrating it right where my crease starts. Now I'm taking my MAC 224 blending brush and going over the brown shades and buffing and blending motions just to get a really seamless blended eyeshadow look. And I'm gonna be doing the same steps on my other eye as well. 
Now I'm going to be taking my mini MAC 219SE brush in my Anastasia Beverly Hills Illuminator in So Hollywood and I'm going to be applying that in the inner corner of my eyes for a more awake appearance and a little golden pop. After applying this to the inner corner of my eyes, I'm going to be taking my Dior Show Maximizer as usual and putting that on my bottom lashes, prepping for the mascara I'm going to apply afterwards. Then I'm taking my House of Lashes in Iconic and applying those off camera. You can see these are nice and dramatic and gorgeous. And I'm going over my liner one more time just to get any glue that could be showing and just to freshen up the blackness. Then I'm taking my favorite mascara of all time, my Dior Show, and applying that to the falsies just to blend my natural lashes and the falsies together really nicely. Then I'm taking another favorite of mine, my Dior Show New Look, and I'm applying that to both sides of my bottom lashes as well. And here's my baby Romy. He always bothers me when I film. You'll meet him soon in my get to know me video. And then I'm taking my Dior Show mascara. I applied on the top lashes and applying that to my bottom lashes as well. For lips today, I'm going to be using one of my favorite reds, my Kylie Cosmetic Lip Kit in the shade Mary Jo K. And I am applying the liner first. I've been listening to your guys' comments and suggestions. I'm going to be doing a lip kit review very soon out of all the colors that I have, so stay tuned for that. I'll keep you updated. Also, I'm going to be doing a giveaway very soon, exclusive to my YouTube subscribers and my beauty Instagram followers, so hurry and follow me on both of those because I'm going to be giving away tons of prizes, and one of them is going to be one of my favorite shades out of the Kylie Cosmetic Lip Kit, so you don't want to miss this if you love Kylie Cosmetics and you want to try out her products and you haven't had the chance to yet. <music> And we're finished with my go-to look when I wear a red lip. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to thumbs up this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel as well as follow my beauty Instagram. All of my social media pages are linked below. And that's it. I'll be seeing you guys very, very soon. <laughs>